Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. This is going to be very interesting. As you can probably tell by the title that I'm probably going to name this, we are doing a BuzzFeed Creates My Sin. And I don't know if anybody's done this before, I didn't look it up, but I'm sure I'm not the only person who has thought of this. So I'm not in any way saying that I came up with this because I'm positive that someone else has already done it. But we're just doing it for fun. I, I thought of it one day and thought, you know, that'd be really, really funny because I love, you know, I have a guilty pleasure for the BuzzFeed quizzes. I love taking them and finding out, oh, here is your birthday, depending on what Pop-Tart you like. So <laughs> I really like those kinds of quizzes. So that's why we're here. I'm gonna have BuzzFeed create my sim using can we guess quizzes. And the first one that immediately caught my attention was Take this extremely difficult Gossip Girl Would You Rather quiz and we'll guess your first initial, which is very interesting because that'll help us create our name. So we're going to take it. And we are taking this because I love Gossip Girl. I've watched all of Gossip Girl and I love that show. And so that's why we're here. I know all the characters. So this will be a piece of cake for me. Would you rather scheme with Blair or shop with Serena? That's a hard one, actually. I think that I'd rather scheme with Blair. Because I hated Blair in the beginning, but like, I love her character so much. Serena's kind of like, she was hit and miss with me a lot in the series, so definitely scheme with Blair. Who would you rather hook up with? Dan, Chuck, Nate, or Carter? <sighs> See, I really liked Dan throughout the entire series. He started getting kind of weird around the end. And like, I wouldn't get with Chuck because he's kind of like a... I love his character, don't get me wrong, but like, I don't know. And definitely not Carter, so I think Nate. Because he's like, he's very sweet. And he's very attractive, so there you go. Who would you rather have as a parent? Lily, Cyrus, Rufus, or Eleanor? Oh, definitely Cyrus. Cyrus is so awesome. If you haven't seen Gossip Girl, I highly encourage you to watch it because it's very cheesy and like at times very cringy, but it's like a good kind of cringy. Who would you rather be BFFs with? Um, Lola, Eric, Vanessa, or Jenny? Well, definitely not Jenny because like she's crazy. <laughs> And like, Eric, nah, he's okay. I honestly can't, can't really remember Lola. <laughs> she was not left that big of an impression on me. So Vanessa, for sure. Who would you rather scheme with? Georgina, Ivy, Poppy, or Juliet? Mmm, I think probably Georgina because I don't like any of these three characters whatsoever. So Georgina. Where would you rather live? The Humphrey Loft, the Waldorf Penthouse, Chuck's Penthouse Suite, or the Vander Woodson Apartment? I really like the Humphrey Loft a lot. And finally, pick a couple. Chuck and Blair, Eric and Jonathan, Dorota and Vanya, and Dana and Serena. Oh, definitely Chuck and Blair. Like, they're the major OTP. You got H, Y, E, D, J, U, or Z. That doesn't really help me make a name. <laughs> I think that I will just go, I don't know. We'll pick Z. I like that. I'm running it down. <laughs> This is kind of interesting. We only need five questions to figure out what your future career should be. And like, that's not going to be like a, a cast thing, but I'll give them a, a career based on this result outside of cast. What sounds like the perfect activity on a Friday night? Having a good debate with my family, binge watching Netflix with my pets, cooking dinner for my partner, having a structured discussion on a controversial topic, doing volunteer work with some friends, or partying at a club. Perfect activity on a Friday night. Hmm, let's see, I think that, well, I don't want to answer all of them like how I would answer because I don't want to create me, I want to create like a random sin. So I'm going to close my eyes and randomly select an answer. So uh, I promise I'm closing my eyes. What did I pick? Cooking dinner with my partner. No, that's cute. How many kids do you want in the future? Three, zero, one, four, five, or two. Okay, and close my eyes again and bam. Four kids? Uh-uh. <laughs> what was your best subject in school? Science, health, lunch, gym, English, or history? I'm closing my eyes again and bam. Lunch? <laughs> That's a mood. What is your favorite color? Pink, gray, yellow, orange, blue, and purple. Okay. Bam. Oh, it was gray. Okay. I'll write that down. Gray is my is the Sims' favorite color. <laughs> And finally, how would your friends describe you? Argumentative, kind, popular, talkative, smart, or creative? Okay, here we go, and bam. It's near talkative, so let's do that. A chef, 
You are creative, quick thinking, hardworking, and a successful crowd pleaser. You love to entertain, which would make you a fantastic chef. Save us a table at your future restaurant and get ready for all the rave reviews. That's kind of cool. I'll write that down. Okay, so chef. And they're talkative, so I would assume they would be like outgoing, right? I'm writing it all down so I know. This will be interesting. Eat food in every color and we'll tell you the next tattoo you should get. Pick a red food. Okay, I'm closing my eyes and... Wait, what did I just do? <laughs> Apparently I click on the link, but I chose strawberries. How about some green food? Okay, a salad. Just get something blue to nom on. The ice cream looks really good. But I'll close my eyes and we will select a food. Where's my mouse? Oh, I didn't even click on it. <laughs> Blueberries, okay. And something purple. Eggplant, ugh. Oh, all these purple foods do not look good. So I'll just do a little, 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 little. Okay. <laughs> Finally grab some orange grub. Ooh. Are those fries? Mmm, fried potatoes. Oh, click it closing my eyes and bam. I keep like stopping there. A quote tattoo. You'll be getting a very meaningful quote permanently tattooed on your body so you can always read it when you're feeling low. Okay, I don't think they have any quote tattoos in in casts, but we'll, th we'll make it work. So a quote tattoo. <laughs> I don't know how many of these I'm gonna do, but I'll figure it out. Oh, perfect, here we go. Design your perfect house and it will reveal your hair color with 100% accuracy. Okay. First, choose your exterior. Okay. Ooh. I really like these two. I like that one the most, actually. But I will close my eyes and rest the mouse on what I want to select. And I want to choose this one. This one. Okay. Now choose the kitchen. Oh, they're all so pretty. That one kind of weirds me out, though. I kind of like to have, like, more traditional modern cutesy kitchens. Like, this one is, like, so cute. I feel like this would be the most modern that I would ever do. But you guys don't care about that. We're gonna close my eyes and I'm gonna rest over the one that we're gonna choose. This one. Hey. How about a pretty bathroom? Ooh. Okay. Oh, that one's really nice. I love that. Oh, this one. Okay. And a cozy bedroom. Let's see. Oh, the canopy's so pretty. And we're selecting this one. Oh, this blue one, okay. Which dining room speaks to your soul? Oh, that one is so cute. This one, okay. Finally, choose an extra fun feature. H having a bowling alley in your house would be amazing. Oh, hey, red hair. Your hair is red, just like the legends Lucy Ball, Emma Stone, and Amy Adams. Okay, that's cute. Okay, here's one. Create your everyday makeup look and we'll tell you what you should wear today. What's your skincare routine? Let's see. Um, that one. Not even on the ball. I feel like this isn't random enough. Maybe I should get out like a randomizer. I use water only. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to find a random dice generator <laughs> so that way we can, or random number, or random number generator. Okay, one through four, generate. Two, a bit of each is how much foundation we use. Which do we use the most of? Blush, highlight, bronzer, or none? Generate. None, <laughs> she uses none of those. What color is your mascara? Brown, clear, I don't use it, or black? Generate one. Okay. Well, she does have red hair, so that makes sense. Choose a lip gloss color. Pink, red, I don't use it, or nude. Four. Nude lip gloss. Okay. One last product. Eyeliner, fun eyeshadow, other, or nude eyeshadow. Two. Fun eyeshadow. Oh, I love this. A t-shirt and a skirt will be the outfit that she's wearing. Okay. Well, we have the outfit done. Here's an interesting one. We know what type of personality you have based on these your answers to these random questions. Choose a profession. Doctor, lawyer, teacher, or singer? Singer. Okay. So she likes to sing. How would people describe you? Wise, kind, chill, or loyal? Kind. She's very kind. What would you do if you found a bunch of money? Buy a house, find the owner, start a business, or go to college? Start a business. Okay. 
So she's business savvy. I dig that. Maybe oh, she opens her own restaurant. Oh my God, this is all coming together. How many kids do you want? Oh, we already answered this one. It's four, isn't it? We're just gonna say five. <laughs> Funny, you love to joke around and prank people. You're always the light of the party. Okay, that's awesome. So she like, she's funny, life of party, and prankster. Okay, 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 okay. Now I've gotta find an eye color one. Take a dream vacation and it will accurately guess your eye color. Here's another one. We'll guess your eye color based on the photos you choose in every color. We have play which cereal must go and we'll guess your age and eye color. There's a lot of these actually. My lord, there's way too many of these. Well, maybe we can, let's do the cereal one. That one sounds interesting. Play which cereal must go and we'll guess your age and eye color. Which peanut butter cereal must go? Panda puffs, go lean, oh. All right, well, we'll generate one through four. Three, panda puffs are gonna go. Which chocolatey cereal must go? Oh, Cocoa Pebble, oh, Cocoa Puffs. One, Crave must go, good choice. Which healthy cereal must go? Life Cashy Go Lean. The Go Lean is not good. Oh, Grape Nuts are worse. Oh, four. Okay, see, this generator is thinking the same thing I am. Which fruity cereal must go? Honestly, Fruity Pebbles. Get that out of my life. But she thinks Fruit Loops must go. So, I mean, you do you, I guess. Which Special K cereal must go? Oh, the Red Berry one is really good. I've never had the Fruit and Yogurt, though. Four. Fruit and Yogurt is going to go. Which Cheerio cereal must go? Hmm, let's see. One, normal Cheerios. <laughs> Which super sweet cereal must go? Oh, I love all of these. Wait, no, never mind. I don't like Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Don't at me. Generate, Frosted Flakes are gonna go. Which random cereal must go? Cotton Candy Crunch? Oh, wait, Honey made me a s'more cereal? How is Corn Flakes a random cereal? I guess Cotton Candy Crunch is going. 16 with hazel eyes? She's 16? All right, well, she's a teenager and she has hazel eyes. She sounds really pretty so far. Maybe I should take this one for her name. This quiz will reveal what your name should have actually been. How would your friends describe you? Sweet, loud, reserved, or compassionate? Reserved. Well, I mean, she says that she's pretty outgoing. Maybe I should answer this according to what I have so far. Because she's very funny and a prankster, but I, don't, I can't see her being reserved. So maybe she's very, um, She's, she was kind in one of them, so we'll go ahead and pick sweet. Favorite fruit. We picked blueberries in one of these. Let's pick that again. Pick a house you wouldn't mind living in. Ooh, okay, I'll generate this one. Four. Oh, that's cute. Pick a cat to pet. Oh, they're all cute. Oh. Two. That one. That one's cute. What's most important to you? Wealth, family, happiness, or good health? Happiness. What's your favorite social media platform? Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, or Twitter? They like Twitter. Spencer? I guess we never decided that it was a female, right? I mean, Spencer would be a cute name for a girl, too. Are there any more name quizzes, perhaps? Well, it, tell me Spencer. I can't go back on my word. It's Spencer. Well, I think that is actually enough to go off of for now. So let's go ahead, get out of BuzzFeed, and then hop into our game. Well, because she has freckles, I should probably give her like a pretty like fair skin, right? So let's do that. She's a teen, so let's change that to that. Go with my go-to eyebrows. And then hazel eyes, let's see. Those, those aren't hazel. Which ones are hazel? Those are like hazel, right? Let me look it up. <laughs> Cause hazel eyes are like brown. Yeah, they're like brown with like green. So it kind of looks like that, yeah. All right, well that sounds good. Let's just do that then. This is a ran randomly generated sim and like it actually turned out pretty good. I actually really like the pouty lips where like a little bit of teeth are showing. I don't know, maybe this is me, but I think it's really cute. We should probably give her her hair now. So, oh, we should have done a quiz for like what her hair looks like. Okay, so this one says, choose a festival look and we'll guess your facial hairstyle and what you want it to be. Facial hairstyle? What does that even mean? There's just a bunch of like color ones. Okay, this one says, we can guess your hairstyle with one simple question. Which alcoholic drink is your fave? So that's a what, a one through nine? Well, she's a 16 year old, but like, I assume that she parties, right? I mean, don't, I don't condone underage drinking. <laughs> so one through nine. We are doing this purely for hair reasons. Okay, eight, it shows eight. So regular old beer. 
Ugh, that's gross. You typically wear a no-nonsense ponytail. Okay. All right, sure. <laughs> like that one's too- Oh, she's super cute! Oh, I mean, this is kind of like a braid, so it's not necessarily no-nonsense, but... This is another cute one. I mean, this is like a half-up. But it's cute, though. I could see her wearing this. This one's cute, too. I mean, it doesn't really come in her hair color. Well, I guess that's, that's basically her hair color, but like... The, uh... Hairline isn't looking too hot. <laughs> this one's really cute. Very elaborate though. What this one? Ooh, that one's really cute. This is also a very low maintenance ponytail. Very long, but very low maintenance. It's actually really cute. This is also a very low maintenance ponytail. I have a lot of like half up, half down hairstyles, but not a lot of ponytails. I think that one was my favorite. I'm trying to find it again. <laughs> The one with the cute, like, there we go. The boop. That is so precious! And so we'll get rid of her yeah, eyelashes. And then we'll put on some cutie little brown ones, because she uses brown mascara. Maybe she'll have big eyelashes. Oh, that's too big. Oh, those are actually pretty nice. A little too extra for a teenager, though. I mean, teens these days were crazy. Crazy mascara and stuff. Like... I was very uh, bad with makeup when I was in high school, but there are girls that are like 11 that are like super mega stars with makeup, so it's nuts. I'm not really digging any of these, honestly. I suppose this one is okay. And she has a tattoo, even though she's a teenager. Can teens even get tattoos? Like in The Sims? Let's take all your clothes off. Can they get tattoos? Ooh, we got a rebel on our hands. Okay, well, let's see. These are all the, like, the back ones. Oh, that one's... No thanks. That's kind of cool. Oh, that one's really elaborate. Oh! That one's cute, little constellation. Ooh, that one's cute, too. All of these do not look good. What is this one? Oh, that one's cute. Yeah, let's go with that one, then. That one's, like, tasteful. And it's on her back. So we'll let's go with that. All right, so her outfit is a t-shirt and a skirt. And the picture had a tank top, so I don't really know why they said t-shirt and skirt, but we'll just go with the tank top and skirt. Well, let's, cho let's choose a skirt first. Something like, it was very like edgy in the picture. She's actually kind of cute. The like, it looks like it's kind of tucked into the skirt and stuff. And I think the skirt's actually really cute. Well, she's a very, like, easygoing kind of person, so I feel like she would wear some really easygoing shoes, too. Maybe, like, some, like, cozy, like, tennis shoes. This is actually really cute. Like, the socks and stuff. That's really precious. Let's see. Is there, like, a jacket or something that I could put over her tank top? You have, like, that coat, but, like, that doesn't really fit the aesthetic. There's, like, a cute vest. Uh, I don't know. Well, I guess she's fine. It also says that she wears very fun eyeshadow. So, like, fun eyeshadow. This one is very fun. <laughs> oh my, these are very fun. Well, something that matches her outfit. Like, this one is, like, really cute and totally matches. So maybe we'll just give her some really subtle eyeliner to go with it. That's cute. That's actually really cute. And she doesn't wear highlighter or blush or anything. But I did say that she likes to wear a nude lip gloss. So let's do that. These are actually pretty dark, so maybe not those ones. It actually said her favorite color is gray, so maybe I should make the skirt gray. I can't make it gray though, let me make it white. Maybe the tank top can be gray? Eh, uh, doesn't look as good. We'll just ix that for now. All right, well this is her so far, so let's go ahead. And it says that she likes to be a prankster. And she loves, like, she loves to cook a lot, so I, may, I might make her master chef. And we'll make her Hmm. I could have sworn there was a mischievous trait. I guess goofball would be a good one. And it said that she's very talkative, so outgoing. And her name is Spencer. Spencer. Let's do one, two, three, four, five. Spencer Voss. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. Alrighty, well, that is that for this video. <laughs> 
And I hope that, it, I think that she turned out pretty cute, actually. I mean, like, the, uh, the outfit is cute, and, like, her, like, face is super cute. Oh, I wanted to give her flat freckles. Hold on, I'm not done yet. Like, oh my god, that's so cute. Look at that. Okay, now she's finished. She's super cute. Spencer Voss is her name, and she's very, very cute, very pretty. And I would do all of her other outfits, but I've already been doing this video for a long time. So I think one outfit is good enough. I can always go back and give her more outfits later. I'm going to incorporate her into my save file, so that way she can be played later, probably. I mean, she has CC, so maybe not. Whatever. <laughs> well, I hope that if you're watching this, you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed recording it and playing it, as always. If you like what you saw, go ahead and leave a like, comment, or subscribe. I'm trying to make videos at least twice a week. And I will see everybody in the next one. Bye.